हेलो फ्रेंड्स आई एम संजय गुप्ता इन दिस वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट स्किल बेस्ड इंटरव्यू क्वेश्चंस रिलेटेड टू सी प्रोग्रामिंग बिफोर स्टार्टिंग यू कैन नोट माय इंफॉर्मेशन व्हिच इंक्लूड माय ऐप बुक्स एंड यूट्यूब चैनल सो फर्स्ट स्किल बेस्ड क्वेश्चन इज दिस इज अ कोर्ट सेगमेंट यू हैव टू आइडेंटिफाई आउटपुट ऑफ दिस कोर्ट सेगमेंट सो आई एम शोइंग द आउटपुट एक्स विल प्रिंट जीरो एंड वाई विल प्रिंट 10. Now I am explaining uh, how zero uh, and 10 will be printed. So you can see initially x is zero and y is 10. Then if condition is there, uh, if has two expressions which are uh, joined with logical or. So first is x and second one is y plus plus. So x is zero. That's why this condition will be treated as false. But in case of or. If first condition is false, then second condition will also be checked. So y plus plus is written here. Y is 10. So plus plus will be performed later on. So y is 10. 10 means true because it is non-zero value. So overall, this if condition will be considered as true. Means this printf which is connected connected with if will be executed. But y plus plus will convert value of y from 10 to 11. then this printf will be executed so it has x plus plus and minus minus y so this x plus plus is post increment that's why x which uh, sorry whose value is 0 uh, will be printed first after printing a value of x uh, as 0 it will become 1 but it will print output as 0 then minus minus y it is pre decrement so Uh, here value of y becomes 11 so minus minus y means uh, 11 uh, again becomes 10 so y will print 10 on console so in case of post increment first value is printed then it is incremented but in case of pre decrement first value is decreased and then it is printed on console this is another code segment in this code segment x uh, is a variable which is declared as unsigned then for loop along with printf so you can see the output of this code segment it will print 10987654321 then 655353434 up to infinite times so why so because x is unsigned so in case of unsigned we cannot store any negative value it means range will be Zero two six double five three five. So loop is started from ten. Condition is true. Ten ten is greater than equals to zero. So first ten is printed. Then x becomes nine. Again condition is true. So nine is printed. So uh, till zero this condition will be true. So from ten to zero all the digits will be printed. Then again x minus minus. So before zero minus one minus one occurs. But uh, x is uh, unsigned integer. that's why before zero the number will be 65535 that's why after zero this number is printed then when we decrease x again so number will be 65534 and so on then uh, after continuous decrement control will again uh, come to uh, zero then again 65535 so there is a loop which will uh, uh, execute infinite times because this termination condition will be true always this is another code segment in this code segment x is a variable then while uh, it is a loop which is followed by x minus minus and then printf statement is written so output of this uh, code segment will be zero now uh, listen the answer carefully initially x is 1 then while is checking x double equals to 1 which is true so we have not used curly braces here that's why this x minus minus is only linked with while this printf statement is separated with while loop so uh, when x double equals to 1 is true x minus minus will be performed so value of x becomes 0 again x is compared with 1 so right now value of x is 0 so 0 double equals to 1 means condition is false so this loop uh, will get terminated then control will transfer to printf so printf is printing uh, x which is zero right now 
this is another core segment here again while loop is used then it is containing printf and g++ so its output will be garbage value why so uh, because j is not initialized and we are checking j less than equals to 10 so we don't know what value is available inside j so uh, it may be possible that this loop will not uh, execute any time or it may be possible that this loop will execute certain number of times so best uh, output of this program will be garbage value so you don't uh, you don't know what uh, value or how many times values will be printed on console because uh, the simple reason is we have not initialized j with a specific value this is another code segment here x is 10 then while loop followed by printf statement so its output will be bmw infinite times now listen the uh, answer carefully x is initially 10 then while is containing x equals to 20 it means 20 will be assigned into x because this single equals to operator is used so single equals to operator works as assignment operation so every time 20 will be assigned into x so 20 is a non zero value so non zero values uh, are always considered as true so x is 20 20 is true so printer will print bmw again 20 will be assigned into x then bmw will be printed so every time whenever loop condition is tested 20 is assigned into x and x is con considered as true because 20 is a non zero value so bmw will print infinite time because this loop will not get terminated uh, any time thank you for watching this video hope these questions uh, which are based on skill uh, oriented so these questions will be beneficial for your placement purposes thank you for watching this video